As the region's only dedicated children's hospital, we really understand how tough it is to be the family member of a seriously unwell child and how important it is that children can easily access the specialist care they need. We also know that parents and patients might be anxious about what the proposed changes to the principal treatment centre may mean for their care. We want to help put their minds at ease. The current children's cancer service is not closing. It is moving to a new hospital. The vast majority of the existing children's team at the Royal Marsden will move too, meaning children and their families will continue to be supported by the clinicians they know and they trust. At Evelina London, we already care for children with cancer. We provide specialist heart and kidney care to the current principal treatment centre and our intensive care ambulance team transfers the sickest children with cancer between hospitals, including transferring children between the Royal Marsden and St George's. As well as state-of-the-art facilities, our plans involve making travelling to the new centre as worry-free as possible. This includes a fleet of cars that will collect children from their homes wherever they live, bring them to the hospital and drive them safely home afterwards. There will also be free, bookable parking for families who travel in their own car, a drop-off zone right outside the door, and hassle-free reimbursement of ULEZ and congestion charging. Moving the Children's Cancer Centre provides a once-in-a-generation opportunity to build on what the exceptional teams at the Royal Marsden already do. Evelina London is the only option that can offer children access to a broad range of paediatric experts 24 hours a day and we have been independently assessed as offering the best opportunity to advance children's cancer research. Bringing the principal treatment centre to Evelina London will mean that children with cancer in our region will benefit from being cared for in a dedicated children's hospital, just like every other child with cancer in the UK. This is what children in our region deserve.